Well, good morning. It's nine o'clock. It's Saturday and it's Handicap King time again. Neil Maurice here after, I think you'll agree, a very profitable time of things over the last four mornings. Some lovely winners. Of course, I do concentrate on my handicap bets. They're all big priced each way advices. And um, today there will be a slight move in direction because as well as a couple of juicy each way handicap king bets, I will have my first win bet of the whole longevity of the service. And this is a horse running in Ireland. More about that yesterday. Well, when we look at the way things have gone so far, we've kicked off with a lovely 9-2 to two winner, Carn Wenon at Newcastle, followed that in with Eva Kailachi winning on the all-weather at 5-1, to one. and then another lovely winner, well back from 7-1 to one into 6-1, to one, which is one for you, that one winning over the jumps for Philip Hobbs. And yesterday, well, the three bets, two of them, very nice placed collections, including an 11 to 1 shot Griggy at Newcastle, which made it another trip to the payout counter and a winning day overall. Today, I'm going to press the accelerator because, as I said, as well as these two lovely each way normal handicap king bets, we have the win bet at Navan. Now, I'd like to mention the Mark Your Card service. You've heard about this. It's it's concerning the 28 races at the Cheltenham Festival. Mark Your Card, my own personal club, and that is a £20 pay-for service, but it gives you an advice in each of the 28 races. They're my nap selections. They include the big handicaps, horses at 25 to 1, 33 to 1, even bigger, that I will give you on every evening. The 6 o'clock is the time to get those bets, but the important thing is they will only come to you via text and email. They are not available on this channel. Not available on this channel. They will be sent to you, dispatched direct by text and email on every preceding night of the Cheltenham Festival. So therefore, on the Monday at six o'clock, you will receive the bets for Tuesday. For Tuesday, it will be six o'clock for the bets for Wednesday, etc., etc., as we go through the week. It's just 20 quid. And if you want to get on board, I've been selling this and I will tell you now the 100 available membership uh, cut-off point is getting very close. I very much uh, encourage you to join while you can. 20 quid and pay on the link below. That's the Mark Your Card Cheltenham Club. Well, without any more hesitation or ado, let's go to the bets today. And the first one, well, this is a horse running at Kelso. And it's a trainer that I think can have a big double header day today. He's a trainer on the up and up called Tom Lacey. And in this 2-5 at Kelso, he saddles horse number one, Sebastopol. Now, the important thing about this horse is he's had a breathing operation and he's back over a more favourable, longer trip today. That is very much going to be in his favour. He's an each way play, Sebastopol, number one in the five past two at Kelso, currently trading at 15 to two across the board. 15 to two right now, each way, Sebastopol. Now, um, the uh, next bet that I've got for you, well, this runs in the 12.55 race at Kelso. And this is an another each way bet. And it's horse number two, Fair Kate from the Lacey Stable. Well, this horse has got all the boxes ticks, ticked in the way of jockey, trip and ground, everything in its favour. It's well weighted. Number two, Fair Kate, trading at 11 to 2 in three or four places. That's another each way play. And last but not least, on to that first win bet that I've ever given out. It runs in Ireland from a very good source of mine. It's a very much special bet, this, running at Navan. And uh, it's a horse that I think is going to go... Uh, go in without any recourse for each way comfort zone betting. This is very much a win bet and it's horse number one, Sovereign Gold. And it runs in the five past five at Navan, ridden by uh, Rachel Blackmore for man in the news, Henry de Bromhead, a seven-year-old mare, every inch a chaser. And I think that this horse will prove a cut above its field under the uh, redoubtable Rachel Blackmore, a bet 
to savour at the end of the afternoon the 5-5 at Navan Sovereign Gold. Without any more hesitation, I will tell you that I'm signing off now, but I will be back at the same time. That will be nine o'clock Sunday tomorrow to bring you up to date with more Handicap King bets. And until then, enjoy your Saturday.